you, you can't listen. You can't listen to that, that kind of stuff. Yeah. You, man, you got to keep your mind stayed on the Lord. You got to stay, you got to stay focused. Yeah. And that's where the devil always get it, get us to lose focus. Yeah. Our circumstances get us to lose focus. Yes. Before you know the year ain't going by because you stuck on. Like they used to, like we used to say, stuff them stupid. I'm not saying you're stupid or you know, don't, 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 don't get me wrong. But we get stuck on stupid. Yeah. I don't, I don't want to allow, I can't allow that to happen in my life. Mm -hmm. I don't have no, no more time to waste 51 years old. Mm -hmm. I told my kids, you know, they're in their 20s, most of them, one of my sons 30. Like, man, you sitting around talking, 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 right? Pretty soon you're going to be my age and still talking, talking, talking. Mm -hmm. And then you're going to wonder where all the years are gone, where all the time is gone. Right. So it's time, like, you know, try to get the young people to understand. Like David, David was a youngster, but he moved. 17, maybe around 17, he didn't wait. Mm -hmm. He let the Bible tell him, man, you're not even the age older than you're not even 21 yet. Mm -hmm. What you talking about? They were like, man, I'm going for it. <laughs> so, uh, uh, the first time I read I am our dog, that you come after me with a stick, and he cursed him by his God. Come on, said the Philistine. <laughs> the bullies. Mm -hmm. yeah. But he wasn't just a bully at all. He actually was a, a warrior. Right. I made roll kill of you. For the buzz. He done that for other people. So it, it's real talk. Mm -hmm. I'm talking about real talk. This is real talk. And just because it's real talk don't mean that's going to be for you. Right. Just because it's real talk and it doesn't bug you. Just because the devil talking a lot of other people. Right. Just because circumstances have defeated other people don't mean it's going to defeat you. Right. Right. I'll just be looking at what's happened to other people. Look yeah. at God and what, how he brought you through the other circumstances. And how he's been on your side all this time. He can bring you this far to leave you. He ain't going to do the work in you. He's going to continue on. Hallelujah. He said, I'll turn you into a tasty morsel for a few of mice. David answered, You come at me with a sword and spirit and battle axe. I come at you in the name of God of the army of the angel of armies, mm -hmm. the God of Israel's troops, mm -hmm. whom you curse and mock. Look at what he said. Told you, if you believe it, you got to speak it. Yes. You got to say it. You got to declare that. If, if you're too afraid to speak it out and declare it, you don't really believe it. Right. So you, you got to be able to declare it. You got to get out and speak it and say, you know what? Today is going to be a good day. Today is going to be the day of victory. Today is the day of my overcoming. Today is going to be the best day of my life. Today I'll never see a broke day again. Today I'll never see another frustrated day again. Today! So then I can see David getting all scared and shaking in his boot and say, okay, man, you win. You know, and run back. But David like, man, I, I believe I, I'm going to defeat you. And I'm, let, let me tell you how I'm going to whoop you. Right. <laughs> and and what, I, what I'm about to declare to you right now is going to happen just like I said. That's right, man. Hallelujah. He said, David said, this very day. Yeah, I'll tell you. And, 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 and here's the key. Never forget that it is God that does it. Yes. And they right. knew who was right. going to do it for him. Yes. Right. This very day, God is handing you over to me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> wow. 